12 days of Christmas. In the 16th century, England Catholics were not allowed to practice their faith. If they were caught learning about their religion, they were imprisoned or even put to death. To make sure that young Catholics could learn the basics of their faith, two Jesuit priests had a brilliant idea. They composed a carol called The Twelve Days of Christmas. For each of the twelve days from Christmas to Epiphany, the composers created a code for basic truth of the Catholic faith. On the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me, true love equals God. A partridge in a pear tree represents Jesus, the Christ reigning from the cross. Two turtle doves represent the Old and New Testaments. Gold, frankincense, and myrrh. The three French hens, the three gifts of the matri. Four calling birds are the three gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. Five golden rings represent the five first books of the gospel. The six geese laying are the six precepts of the church. To go to Mass and to go to confession. To receive Eucharist and receive days and observe days of fasting. Provide for the needs of the church and to avoid marriage laws. I mean, and to obey. <laughs> so, geez. The seven swans of Slovene represent the seven sacraments. Of reconciliation and baptism. Reconciliation, mm-hmm. Eucharist, confirmation, holy orders, anointing of the sect, matrimony. Can you try it one more time? The eight maids of milking represent the Beatitudes. Blessed are the poor in spirit, for theirs in the kingdom of heaven. Blessed are the meek, for they, the, they shall possess the land. Blessed are they who mourn for they shall be comforted. 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 Blessed are they that hunger and thirst after justice, for they shall have their fill. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Blessed are the clean of heart, they shall see God. Blessed of the puke makers, well, for they should be called the children of God. Blessed are they for the suffering persecution. persecution. The nine ladies dancing represent the nine choirs of angels. The angels, archangels, and principalities. The powers, the powers and virtues. And Dominations, thrones, cherubim, cherubim and seraphim. The boy. The ten lords are leaping. 
re represent the Ten Commandments? The Ten Commandments are our rules for life. The eleven pipers piping are the eleven apostles after Judas's death. The twelve drummers drumming, the leaves we name when we play the Apostles' Creed. We hope you enjoyed listening to our slidecast of the twelve days of Christmas. Finally I got it right.